Welcome, Legionnaires, to a brand new Let's Play on Crusader Kings 2, going to be known as From Venice Comes Gold. So we are going to be playing as is Venice. Uh, we're going to be playing as Patrician Alexander. So I haven't actually locked it in, but I've created him. This is our coat of arms, and blah, 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 Alexander Hill. Grey Eminence, Lunatic, Wounded, majority, pretty much all of the normal traits I have, but we're having a lot less because it makes the game a bit easier if we have too many. So first things first, we're going to press finish, and we're going to press play. And the next thing we're going to do is instantly build our thing here. We're going to set our camp uh, uh, court up. He was the ex person. He was the person I uh, writ over. So the fact that he likes me is a bit weird. Improve relations with people here so I don't die. Because uh, patricians seem to die a lot. Definitely got to improve stuff uh, relations with our religious head as he doesn't like as very much as it is. Uh, pick an ambition. Find a place for ambitions, Joe. There we go. Get married. We want this 16 year old, I think. Apparently not. What about this one? Yeah, we'll marry her, I suppose. Apparently we can't marry her either. No, no, we can. There we go. Right, that's that marriage set up. We've got the uh, building set up. Uh, so it's just play. Uh, there's no point asking anyone's concern. And the steward died instantly. Or would stop being the steward. First concern, we just want to have a son. So this character is basically going to be the character we use to set up our, in our in empire. As uh, we're 25, uh, we're just set up a bit, and hopefully my wounded trait goes away so quick, so quickly. Uh, we're always going to be a lunatic, so that really doesn't matter. Uh, we've got some, and that's it, really. Ah, I disappeared quickly. There it is. Uh, you want to marry my courtier, who I was thinking of marrying, but I, for some reason the game wouldn't let me. Yeah, of course you can. Uh, we're going to spend all of our piety bringing on, bringing people to the court, though. He's better. This guy's better at marshalling, so we're going to re-put him there. Stewardship, 17 is the best. Spy master, 16, 16, 16. So there's no really point changing that. Right there we go. We've uh, reset up our council for now. Now all we really need to do is uh, wait for the people to build their trade posts and nick them. That is my um, first goal, to take other people's trade posts. As uh, that will make us a lot of money. Oh, I feel safe straight away. That is her interests, not mine. Wait, my one guy has taken passion from my approach. She keeps reading any sort of security that she can go of. Get more for her to read, lose 10 gold, and she gains lossful. I am okay with that. So we can see to get people killed, and I need the main. The main Doge has built his built his built in um, his uh, trade post, uh, and the Trebino family have been building their trade post. Now the trade post I want to stay clear of anything. This side of Venice. I want to stay clear of them for now, unless they're down right down here. But this side of Italy, I am, I am like here. These three, I will probably take, but I would prefer to get these ones. But unfortunately, they all, all build them in Italy. As I can see, they've built one here, and they've let a mouth man see. We've only built them up here. So the first thing I want to do is declare war on. This guy's family, the Trebino, uh, to take that. So, how much rich are you, Trebino? You've got 150 gold, 180. Well, so you've got enough to hire someone. 
You're weaker than me in levy count. So, um... Do I take your trade post? Well, I could get it could probably be worth more if I took it. So I'm going to take it. Let's go to war with them. Trebino. Oh yeah, the time we must have been going when I was deciding. Oh, there's a hundred extra gold. So the game rewarded me, in in essence, it rewarded me, so I can get my men off here. All we have to do now is the quick job of take that, get men on boats, and I believe uh, drop them back home. There's nothing else we can do, so. What we're going to do is we're going to drop our levies. And um, declare war on the other guy. Uh, no, his is there. So there's no. I don't want to declare war on him for that. Well, these mercenaries are costing us a lot of money per month. So. I'm going to put them down for now. You don't have untouched holdings though. That's the awkward thing, you don't have untouched holdings. Hopefully when it gets 80%, no, still won't accept my piece. It's one of the poorer ones as well. What I am going to do though is build this merchant enclave first, and then merchant port, and then we'll go to the garrison. Uh, I want a level 1 of everything. How many levels do they go to actually? Three. So if we level 3 all them, Venice would make a shit ton of money. And, uh, and with that, that was 100% war score. Which now gives me 2. Which should give me an income bonus. Uh, I believe it does. Yeah, trade zone bonus. Because we now own, as a family, this trade zone. Now, when the uh, Carlings become more stable and, well, when, let me say when a Carling loses this, I will probably build there. But not until. Because, um, yeah, I don't want my trade post being raided to shit. Oh, yes, it's the, what house are you, mate, taking it? You're the Doge, so attacking you would not be a smart idea. Uh, we'll wait until the other families build more, and we'll try and get as many as possible, because we are going to need mansions, and uh, we are going to stay in Venice for a long time, so we'll need this up as well. But yeah, we are getting tech, and that's at least good. But obviously now this will show up, because we are in the trade zone here. We're now making four gold. Oh, fuck's sake. He's the one person I didn't want you to piss off. God damn it, game. Uh, so in Trade Post of Venice, we're going to uh, build the Merchant Enclave, I believe it is. Yeah, Merchant Enclave, which gives us more tax from it. At the moment, our troops are still shit, because um, I believe our troops are counted in from the house we have. Yeah, we can't raise levies from this, so it's a house we've got. Uh, so one hundred, we have uh, one hundred eighty-five technically, but obviously we give some to the uh, liege. The great ball, um, uh, worried Baron, uh, Domenio of Tribuna will soon be hosting a great ball in his family's palace, and every polit push family in the republic is invited. Oh fuck it, we're going. I already know that event. You can just like read it slowly if you want to. Too. And obviously you can read that. I'll just leave it there for a second. Or you can pause the video. So we lose 100 prestige, he gains 100, and we now have a rivalry with this dick. But a family rivalry though, so. Uh, or do we? Normally that would go red if we had a family rivalry with someone. Hmm, maybe not.
My merchant enclave has been built, which should make me more money. It's making Venice 15 gold now. Unfortunately, we won't have control of this sea zone for a long time, uh, much longer, because someone else is going to build it there. You didn't have enough gold to build one. You should do. And you need probably do. Yay, the Doge likes me now. <laughs> Thank God. Uh, hopefully we'll have a son soon. She doesn't like me. Why do you not like me? Uh, because short reign, attracting to lunatic charity, charitable versus greedy. I can try some pleasures. Uh, we are gaining literally no piety, so... Getting her her the one begin with H, can't remember how to say it, but it will come up in a minute, so I'll obviously be able to say. As we, when I see it. And East Frank, Bavaria took East Frank here. As the capital's here. And it's now been moved over here. No, maybe no. Actually, no. He, he was the king of uh, East Francia first, or was it? No, I'd have no clue actually. Whatever. You're the new Doge then. Ah, yes. Tiberno is building a um brand new place and we're gonna take it and yes we are we are feuding families which mean I'm going to take it purely because I hate him wow Aquitaine has the Balearics that's different he was 71 he was going to die it's all good The moment we just really need to wait for a while, so we build up our coffers. So we're going to need at least 150. Well, probably 200 for, for this. Apparently, God is dead. Don't know what happened to him, but apparently, God died. So, um, the post apocalypse should be soon. He doesn't mind that I'm a lunatic or anything, so that's good. King Quit or Venice? Oh, apparently, there was a king of Venice. When did he die? 800, oh, so years ago. He has a Puglia. That's this. No, it's not. It's there. Well done, Joe. You're thinking about Kapua. Well, I'm going to go take that one as well. When I have around 200 gold. It's not a very profitable one, but I'm going to take it. Yeah, my troops have gone down due to limited crown authority. Yay. A military warehouse, a warehouse would really be useful. As it gives us a plus 200% revenue size, which at the moment is zero. We nearly have 200 gold. Oh shit, I have a fucking truce with you. Oh yeah, being the spy master really does help. And I believe his spy master wants you dead, and we have a daughter called Claudia. So it's only me and him. Well, the least le le less people, the better, I suppose. Or is it the more people? But I really don't know. One less douche in my way. Hey look, he has 87 men.
I just murdered them all. Like, could I do this without even needing a thing? If I get there quick enough, yeah, I can. Wow, I didn't actually... Boats go home quickly. Boats cost you more money than anything else. Wow. He has 40 men back there. Oh yeah, I should probably select the boats. That would help. I have a problem. My men could lose this. Like they just did. Um, do I waste 150 gold? Oh, no, he can't siege it anyway, so no, I don't. Which means we just sit on this war for a while. Killing him is not an option, as he'll be able to re-raise his troops then. Or he'll get a fresh batch to raise. Uh, getting rid of our navy is a good choice. For now, because... Why have I got no navy? What the fuck? They were docked. Why did it... Whatever. I really don't care. After this, I'm probably... I should get them back quick enough. Right, you can't siege my holdings. So you just... Ignore it, live life. Yeah, because preferably I would love a second child. Unfortunately, I can't take Hedonist because um, uh, we're already take we don't get enough piety as it is. So taking that trait is not is out of the option out of the question. We're now a scholar, which improves our diplomacy. No learning. So we have we have a decent base character at the moment. could re-raise and probably we beat his troops but he can't siege what he uh, if he can't siege it, I'm not gonna bother you've lost but whatever now oh, Venice has gone down to 10 why is that oh Venice Venice has gone down to six because he's looting the province. Hmm. That's annoying. All right. Now that his troops have gone, give me the give me the thing. Fine. I'll just leave my men here then for now. I joke, I'm putting my men down. I don't need them up. Damn straight, I gained that trade post. Alright, that's that's my trade zone now. Oh, and someone else has this. The do current doge has that. Well, bollocks. <sighs> I'm going to have to quickly be away with him. Because if I'm correct, I think he has like a thousand troops. Nope, 500. Still more than me. Still more than I would want to take on. And he's possessed, so he needs to die. A mayor and a baron want me to kill him. want to help kill him. We could go on a pilgrimage, or... I could finish level what the level uh, one provinces and things in here, which is what I'm gonna do before I work uh, work on the next ones. 
just the way I like to deal with uh, republics. But anyway, we're going to have to leave it off here for part one. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys later. Legionnaire, stay proud to the Shadow Legion.